Hey, what's up, guys? Bowser's reaction pit. Bowser's reaction pit. Uh, <laughs> Why so did you say it twice? I don't know. <laughs> we're going to do some bang tango. We need something to break the uh, monotony. I think I know this song. Um, someone like you. So Not to be confused with the Scorpions. Someone like you. They're, oh, I'm sorry. That's no one like you. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> so... Uh, I think I have an idea what's going on here. He's probably never heard this. Um, I think I know this song. I think I do. So what year is this from? 80s? It's got to be 80s. Yes. Right? Yes. Is it going to be like the Cars? Is it going to be like Aldo Nova or what? I don't know. Let's check it out. <laughs> Think he shines his pants? I love 80s music. I didn't know Kevin Bacon was in a band. <laughs> Kevin Bacon. <laughs> Man, it's just so good. It is pretty I, good, I actually. Lo- that dude's got a, he's got a cool voice. I think I remember the song, and I love the way that, you like know, when and they the play guitar them, they in the they background used to play like their that. instruments. Yeah. <sighs> the, the, the voice. The, uh, and very 80s kind of bass sound, too, like that, like that, you know. I like the little lasers in there. That's what I was doing. Yeah, you're gonna burn a hole in your fucking curtain right there. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, but man, I don't. You know, these guys. I don't think they were that big. They never really got big. He his voice kind of reminds me of like Axl Rose, in a certain sense, without that like nasty attitude added to it. Like if he wanted to, he probably could have, you know, hit the same notes. He could have screeched that same way. Yeah, they have a very similar sounding voice.
Yeah. You know, it's so simple. I mean, the song is not technical. It's so simple. It's not, but, but, they're, but they're good. Like, the little elements that they throw in, like, the little touches like that, and the little details where the guitar does what, you know, the lead singer did with his yeah. voice. Stuff like that. And the bass. Like, the yeah. bass player in this song. This dude... They just bad. had such a good rhythm. Such a driving rhythm. The song just was f- fucking jammed. I liked it. Yeah. Dude had a good voice. Right. Uh... He so, sounded like, like I said, in a in a way, he didn't have like a really high voice, but he could hit higher notes. It was good. Was it awesome. was good. I don't know why I'd never heard this song before. Right. See, good. Yeah, he's playing. You know what? You're, you're gonna be like. All of a sudden, I'm gonna be like, "What you listening to?" Oh, bang tango, you know. Bang tango. <laughs> I've, dude, I've been hanging out with you for like what the last 22 years. You think I'd have heard this song? <laughs> I, you know, I forgot all about these guys. So I mean, but why? I recognize the song. I don't remember. That well, why weren't they more popular? I wonder. Uh, maybe it's a one hit kind of band. Maybe one this is their hit because like, this is what was recommended to me. Maybe it was around that same era. Like maybe Guns N' Roses did knock them out of the out of the running, so to speak. They just dominated, and dudes like this sort of fell to the wayside. They had something good to offer, but right. they just got overtaken. All right, good recommendation. Liked yeah, it. Yeah, good song. <laughs> 